Masks have become something many of us haven't lived without over the past year. In our final story of our Celebrating Volunteer series with the Community Foundation for the Fox Valley Region, here's a woman who's been taking the needle by the thread to not only create masks, but bring together a community during a time of need. Meet this year's winner of the Healthcare Volunteer Award. This year, you were one of several nominations received for the Healthcare Award. Oh and it's a privilege to let you know that you've been selected as the recipient of this year's healthcare award. I was uh, overwhelmed <laughs> to say the least Yay. that somebody oh, who's done <laughs> design and sewing all their lives would get something like this. I still get choked up. So it's a great honor and um, yeah, I was overwhelmed then and now I'm overwhelmed now. After retiring two years ago, Vicki Vogel never thought her 40 plus years in sewing and design would lead to her making masks for the community. That was a once in 100 years opportunity. It was a chance to use my talent, sewing as my art. But when the pandemic hit, it's just what she knew had to be done. With her needle and her thread, she brought together a community of Fox Valley sewers, a group that would come to be known as the Theta Care Mask Makers. The impact that Vicki had in this community during the needs that were emerging from the pandemic, uh, she was a lifesaver, literally a lifesaver for the community. From producing thousands of masks to social distance sewing sessions in her driveway, online sewing tutorials, and flip it over and creating sewing machine maintenance and scissor sharpening sessions. Sometimes I don't have to do this step. Um, it really just depends. These women with their home sewing machines, these home sewing machines weren't made to, to sew like this. The hours that a lot of the ladies were putting in. Vicki was making a difference. It wasn't quantity, it was quality. And it was for everyone in the Fox Valley, whether you knew it or not. It wasn't just about her sewing masks for, for us, for our patients, for our team members, but she mobilized more than 300 sewers. And at the peak of, of um, you know, COVID and the surge, they were pumping out 3,000 masks a week. Her ability to bring a group together in a time of need to help thousands is the reason she was awarded this year's Healthcare Volunteer Award. She has given so many people during the start of the pandemic a sense of hope. An award in which she says is not just hers. I don't look at this as my award, but our award. But the Theta Care Mask Makers. I use a one inch wide by seven inch long strip. Adding the honor is the cherry on top of a long career. This is like a huge, huge honor for a retired grandma. <laughs> I will hold it in my heart for forever. Now, as Vicki mentioned, she felt this award was not just hers, but a group effort between the Theta Care mask makers, their supporters, and the person who helped keep their sewing machines intact. With the $5,000 she was awarded, she decided to donate it to St. Joe's Food Pantry, a group she says aligns with their group and represents their mission. Now, you can hear more stories about the great people who live next door to us. Just type in Celebrating Volunteers on our website.